We have Australia's largest range of tyre brands and sizes. Find a cheaper identical tyre locally stocked and we'll beat it. At Bob Jane T-Marts, we'll look after you. Welcome to Round 5 Doherty Cup action. South Melbourne travelling to take on Berwick City for this Wednesday night fixture. And of course, there's nothing easy about it, John. In Cup action, you can lose to any old club. And we don't know too much about Berwick City, do we? No, we don't, David. They're a State League 2 South East side, but uh, they're going to be dangerous, David. Let's see how we go. The goal kicker we pumped up long. Although that one's got a bit flat and it might uh, fall into a nest of South players. Dimitriaris back in the senior side tonight. Renasevich plays it for Monopolis. Monopolis, the shot blocked and eventually picked up and fumbled, I think. Yes, it's been fumbled straight to Milos Lujic. Referee has uh, seen no foul there. And yes, in fact, he has just taken it straight from the hands of the keeper and put it into the back of the net. 1-0 South Melbourne in the second minute, John. Well, that's what we want, David. A nice early goal to get things rolling as we see Lee Monopolis making a start tonight. Has a shot from outside the box, which the keeper really should have uh, gloved there. But it falls out of his hands and straight to the incoming Milos Lujic. The big centre forward puts it in the back of the net. Gijewadi, one of the uh, more senior players tonight. That's a bit of a mess made of that one with Timmy Marler and uh, Berwick might hit back here. They love one to get themselves back into the game here. The shot goes high and wide that time. A nice attacking intent by Berwick, but uh, nothing coming from it. Marler looking for Lujic and he'll get him eventually. Milos Lujic plays it forward for Slavin Vranasevic. Now, in fact, he's going to get Monopolis, who might give it back to Vranasevic. Monopolis to Boaheen. Vranasevic on the left foot, uh, Slavin Vranasevic, oh great finish, 2-0 South Melbourne. Well this is a fantastic start for them, they're really putting Berwick to the sword early and uh, good to see some of these young players involved in the moves John. Spot on David as we see uh, two of the youngsters, Kobe Bohin and also Slavin Vranasevic linking up for the second goal here. Lovely turn there by uh, Vranasevic and from outside the box and on his left foot he puts into the bottom corner, that's a lovely finish by the youngster for his, for his uh, first goal for South. As we see from behind the goals there, he just uh, hits it into the bottom corner. Not much the keeper can do there. And South have a 2-0 lead. Nice and early, David. Kobe Boaheen. His pace is troubling Berwick City a bit. Here's Vranasevic, the goal scorer. Plays it for Musa. The calm centre back goes in board to Jawadi. Iki Jawadi for Lee Monopolis. Links up with Luic. One on one now. Monopolis with the keeper and he scored. 3-0 South Melbourne. And this is a really, really professional start by them. They've really made things difficult for Berwick City. Exactly what the South fans wanted. 3-0. Probably the best team goal of the night, David, as we see Jawadi plays it through to Monopolis, who then does a 1-2 with uh, Lewich, who sets up Monopolis, and he picks his spot before firing it past the keeper and into the top right corner of the net. Fantastic finish, and it's not even half an hour in, and we have 3-0 up, David. I think the result is pretty much done and dusted. As we see there, Monopolis one on one, and he puts it through in the back of the net. South have a commanding 3 0 lead here. Vranasevic and Lujic. All the South forwards really troubling Beric at the moment. This one, no exception. Monopolis on the right foot. Lee Monopolis puts a shot through, but a uh, couple of metres wide of the upright there and not troubling the keeper. Beric City, they'll uh, look to hit one back before half time, and South haven't managed to get this clear. Dimitriaris jostling with his man but can't get control. They get something going here from the left. That's a nice cross in and that one as it crossed the line. It's scooped out the referee and linesman confer and yes the goal has been paid. I think Maynard might have been trying to con the referee there but it looked like it had crossed the line and Berwick City pulled one back. I think Ashley Savannah with the touch. He was wrestling with Musa. John, let's see what the replay shows us. Yeah, it's hard to tell David whether it came off Ashley Savannah or Musa but one thing we can confirm and it has gone in the back of the net as we see there. Yeah, you still can't tell but uh, it's definitely crossed the line off the post and uh, Chris Maynard trying to escape there but uh, the referee counts the goal. South Melbourne would love to get their pace going on the counter but Berwick City are uh, holding on tightly. No, there's a chance for Lujic played in from Vranasevic. Well, nearly a goal from nothing. There was a crowd of players. Vranasevic found space, found Lujic but couldn't find the net. Eager releases Timmy Marler. He gives it to Lujic. That's a nice ball there, Boahin on the far side. Boahin plays it in for Nasevich. Oh, the header and the follow-up shot just over. While having scored his first goal for the club, he desperately seems to want a second. He's really pushing his case to uh, be included in the senior team, John. Well, the two youngsters again link up, David. Uh, Kobe Boahim setting up 
Banasevic for the second goal earlier tonight. And here we see a lovely cross by Boahin to Banasevic. His header hits the crossbar and on his second attempt, he plays it over the bar. And there's uh, going to be a substitution made here. One senior striker on for another. Jamie Reid comes on for Milos Lujic. Monopolis turns and seems to have a lot of time there. And a lot of space for Kobe Boahin. He might work a shot on the left foot, goes round his man. Kobe Boahin on the right, deflected away by the keeper in Berwick City. Clear. Kobe Boahin wanna, wanting to join the first goal scorers club tonight. Andrew Mullet's cut that off easily and he's played a lovely ball for Jamie Reid. Jamie Reid through and he scuffed his shot and it's gone wide. Having a word with the referee there, Jamie Reid seems to feel he might have been impeded on that attempt. Not looking too happy there, the Englishman. Eager. Dimitiaris, a lot of experience Dimitiaris, perfect for a game like this. Monopolis gives it to Musa, getting forward, Musa left there that time. Now here's a chance for Boahin, Kobe Boahin on the right foot, puts it past the keeper, 4-1. That'll put paid to the game, great work there by Kobe Boahin, it was a nice ball to him and a nice finish and he gets his first goal for the club as well. Yeah, nice to see the youngsters get on the score sheet tonight. Vranasevic scoring earlier and now Kobe Bohim with a well-taken goal. James Musa with the ball across to him. Jamie Reid left it. Falls now to young Bohim who steps past his marker before firing across the keeper and in the back of the net. Very nice finish there. And some fresh blood being brought into this game. Tyson Holmes makes his way on. Bradley Norton too coming onto the field as uh, well. And Nick Epifano maybe putting a bit of pace in the midfield for the last few minutes of this game. Tyson Holmes, oh, fresh onto the park, and that wasn't his best effort. He's lost the ball there, and uh, streaming forward in numbers here, Berwick. They might try to open something up. Uh, he's gone straight through Michael Eager here. Maynard comes out, chipped over him. Boheen puts it up high. Still there, is it? And over the top eventually, Chris Maynard taps it clear. Well, that was a nice move there by Berwick City. Nearly rewarded for it. It's a nice team move here by Berwick and almost the goal of the game, David. Uh, and almost another consolation goal for them. As we see here, Kobe Boheen, the youngster, he's been everywhere tonight, hasn't he, David? He's there clearing the ball off the line after Maynard was chipped. But uh, the big goalkeeper gets back, making his first start for the year. And he tips the ball over the crossbar now for a corner. Michael Eager needs to get something going with a nice high ball out there to Bradley Norton. He plays a flat one in front of Jamie Reid. The shot by Reid, good save by the keeper there. And they can't get a fifth goal, South Melbourne, for all they're trying. They might uh, still open up. The ball stays at the feet there of uh, Monopolis. Shot sits up here for Slavin Vranasevic. The shot uh, straight at the keeper that time. Can't add to his goal tally, the young man. Is there time for Berwick to have one last go forward? No, there's not. The referee puts an end to this game. 4-1 South Melbourne, a very professional effort. Good effort by Berwick City. They showed something in patches in that game, but the professionalism, the experience of South was too much for them, John. It was a good win, David, and Berwick City tried hard, but uh, South were too good in the end, and South have progressed through to the sixth round where they'll meet Danny Nong Thunder away at George Andrews Reserve? Uh, just being a South junior, I've always wanted to play for South and obviously since Chris has given me the chance to play in the cup, I've taken it with um, everything that I have. And at, at the start of the game, I was pretty nervous to start, obviously, because I haven't started at all this year. Even though it's a cup game, I was really proud of myself to start. And um, during the start of the game, uh, I started getting the ball, I started passing it around. And then when the ball came to me, I just thought I'd turn and just have a shot and went in. So went in and I was happy, you know. No, we all trained together really well and we're all a great bunch of uh, boys all together. So um, we've always got good enough players to come in at any time and do the job. So yeah, it was quite easy for a number of us to come in today and progress to the next round. I've been putting a lot of work on and off the park. So, um, you know, I mean, at the end of the day, it's up to Chris. Um, I can only do the best that I, I can produce on the day. So um, yeah, hopefully things start to pick up for me and I start getting a bit more game time. But um, first and foremost, it's about how well the boys can go and um, us yeah, doing as well as we can in the league and the cup.